Recently, Pikeville Medical Center's lab was awarded reaccreditation from the College of American Pathologists. After following strict guidelines and passing inspection, the lab at PMC continues to produce quality results at an efficient rate. PMC lab director Paula Keithley tells us more about the process and the significance of the award. It's an accrediting uh, program that provides accreditation for more than 300, more than 300 hospitals throughout the United States. And what they do is they create a quality set of standards that every, ho every hospital laboratory has to uh, abide by and meet the standards before they can uh, get the accreditation. When the uh, public sees that, that we do try to meet and exceed a high level of standards in the area, they realize how much we do care and appreciate quality and that's what we strive for, for, for the safety and well-being of our, all of our patients. At Appalachian Wireless, we have the best service and the best deals right now. Save up to $500 on iPhone 13s and 14s, all models, all gigabytes with trade-in. Maybe go for an iPhone 12 for a penny. A penny with a two-year contract. We're not leaving out Samsung. Save up to $350 on select Samsung devices, including the S23. It's a win-win this month at Appalachian Wireless. The service, the savings. Y'all got to jump on this deal right now. At Appalachian Wireless, we get you because we are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. AppalachianWireless.com for terms the laboratory staff had made all the necessary preparations for their inspection. Their goal is to minimize risk while continuing to provide excellent service to their patients. A team of eight inspectors came and spent an entire day to inspect the policies and procedures of our laboratory and pathology departments. And we excelled in this particular inspection as we usually do. Supervisors, the managers, and all the staff work so very hard to make it a success, as they do every day. But in particular, they really poured it on to make the, this last inspection a success. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.